check this out. These are plants growing in the middle of the desert. But did you know that these plants can make an airplane fly? Yes, this is airplane fuel that you can eat. Fasten your seatbelt. Today, we're gonna learn something new about the fuel of an airplane. Planes are responsible for 2% of global carbon gas emissions. Why? Because 100% of airplane fuel comes from oil. And that we all know is not sustainable or good for the planet. Aviation contaminates the air by producing CO2 when, they, when planes fly. We don't have electric planes yet. So the only solution we have is to get better fuel. That's it. This is why I came here to Abu Dhabi to show you people who have a better fuel. It's called Sustainable Aviation Fuel and it's coming to a plane near you. This is how it works. Etihad Airways uses this piece of desert land to grow plants. Okay, actually, these plants are very special because they grow in ocean salty water. They don't need fresh water to grow. And on these plants, there's a lot of seeds. And these seeds are full of oil. That's what's unique about them. Then they take the plant, collect its tiny seeds, and crush them to become vegetable oil. This vegetable oil has so much energy that you can turn it into real airplane fuel that can power a Boeing plane. It has the exact same chemical properties and it actually has a higher energy density than normal jet fuel. This fuel is new and promising. It works exactly like normal, but it reduces carbon emissions by 80% in its life cycle. It can be 80% better. Some plants reduce the carbon footprint by 30%, some others by 80%. But when using these types of plants that grow with salt water, we can reduce the carbon footprint by 100%. Today, less than 1% of 1% of flights use sustainable fuel. Etihad Airways did the first ever flight in 2019, but they only did it a few times since because fuel is expensive. The airline business is a small margin business, and so the airlines are making a big effort, but this is an industry-wide effort. It's the airlines, it's the airports, it's the fuel producers, everyone has to participate. This fuel is expensive, but it will get cheaper. The world is working to make more fuel from plants, sugar, corn, and even trash. Ladies and gentlemen, buckle up, because in the future, even trash is going to be powering these planes. Yes, you can make jet fuel from trash. This is why everybody needs to support sustainable aviation fuel. This fuel is the future. We will be using this fuel for the next 10, 20, 30 years. And we need to change our ways and use a fuel that is more sustainable. This is an amazing solution to make flights more sustainable. Just think about it. We can make a plane fly from the energy of a plant. We don't need to ruin the planet just to live.